Jonathan Charles Gray, his first start of the year. It'll be the 205th start of his major league career. John with 69 wins and 64 losses last year. Nine and eight for the Rangers during the regular year. Ian Happ stands in left side. We're ready to roll. Gray's 2-2. Oh, hard bouncer. Nicely snared by a sliding Simeon. And Happ is the first out of the game. Sega Suzuki batting. No score. Just underway. First inning. One down. I drive at a base hit up the middle. Say a Suzuki with a rocket. Gray trying to go down and away with that fastball leaves it uh, up about thigh high. It's a one out single and a scoreless first inning and the batter Cody Bellinger. And that is ball four. So Bellinger will take his base. A single and now a walk. Morell has been swinging a good bat to begin. The ball hard. Drilled left field. This one back. That's on its way. Gone. Home run. Christopher Morrell, a three run blast, and the Cubs jump out front. A bullet to left field, and he stays hot. And Morrell with uh, two hits in each of the first two games. You talk about that near grand slam, but uh, no doubter this time, and the Cubs have a nice little three run cushion here in the first. And he takes strike three call. So Gray gets the strikeout looking, and there are two away. The one two pitch, and got him swinging. Bush strikes out. Gray with a couple of punches, but allowed the three-run homer. Now the Rangers come to bat. Take a look at uh, Jordan Wicks. He got touched up pretty good in his last start, but other than that, he was outstanding. His signature pitch, that changeup. Opposing hitters hit just a buck seventy-one against that uh, changeup from Jordan last season. Simeon two for eight with a couple of walks and a run batted in. Simeon lofts us into center field for the first out of the game, one away. And Langford today getting a start in the field as well, playing left field. And he takes ball four. He's very willing to take those walks. Hard ground ball up the middle. They back up on it to get the out at second. That's all they'll get. Adolis Garcia has that incredible power. 31 years old now. In there, got him looking. Garcia is frozen. Good work by Wicks. He pitches around a one-out walk. A Chicagoland native, Mike Tuckman, left-handed batter. Lined out to left field and a chance for Langford on the slide. He makes the catch. Well, the rookie's first chance defensively and turns in a bit of a sparkler. Well, here he is in left field, sprinting to the line, sliding feet first and making a great play. And one more big swing of the bat. Cubs could really do some damage here in this inning. Here is Seiya Suzuki. Lifts this one straight up in the air. And perhaps a little break as Tavares gets in to make the play. And the Cubs will leave him on the corners. And that is ball four, his third walk already. And with this Rangers lineup, free base runners, extra outs, those are the killers. Now the lineup turns over and 100 RBI leadoff man, Marcus Simeon, come into the plate and right here. Hits this ball hard, left field, that's a base hit. One run is in. Here comes Carter, he scores! Two-run single by Marcus Simeon, and they take advantage of the free base runners. Great job by Marcus Simeon after getting two change-ups to start the bat off. Gets a fastball here, up in the zone, belt high. So Marcus, who knocked in 100 runs last year, up to three now for the season. And the pitch, swing and a miss, strike three. Langford is out, so are the Rangers, but they score twice. And here's Nico Horner to lead off with the Cubs in the fourth. This ball golfed out towards center field. That's a long run, but Duran gets out to it, and he makes the catch. Nicely done by Duran. There are two men on with one out. Cubs looking to add to a three to two lead, have six hits now. And Ian Happ will be the batter. He's grounded out and singled. Green lights him and he rips it into the right center field gap around third and into score is Tachman. Happ is into second. Here comes Amaya on his way to the plate and he'll score. And the Cubs add two. Right, so important to play add on against this Rangers offense. And Ian Happ comes up big here, plating two with that base hit. His second hit of the afternoon. An RBI and an error on the center fielder Tavares. And the Cubs catch a big break. Jared Walsh first up against the lefty Wick. Walsh grounded out his first time up. The 2 2 pitch. Swung on and fisted into right a base hit. And he fought off an inside pitch and just uh, muscled it over the infield. Jared Walsh gets a hit off a lefty. Gives the Rangers a leadoff base runner on their third hit of the day. Here's Evan Carter, who drew a walk on three and two his first time up. A little bouncer up the middle, and that one caroms right off Swanson. Heading to third is Walsh. 
Oh boy, another misplay by the Cubs. That's an error on Swanson. And we'll see if that opens a door. He didn't mark the Simeon bat. Simeon has the two RBIs for Texas. 1-1 one, one pitch. Marcus hits that ball hard. Out to left field. Tauchman is back. It is off the top of the fence. One run scores. Carter gets to third. It's an RBI double for Marcus Simeon. And he's driven in an all three Rangers runs. Boy, that was really close. Almost looked like it hit the yellow. One out. Wyatt Langford up. I'll take this situation. Well, he hammers the ball. That's deep out to center. That one has a chance, but it bangs off the base of the fence. Carter's in. Simeon scores. Langford going for third. He's in there. A triple for Wyatt Langford. First of his major league career. That's power and then that speed. Wyatt crushes that ball. Had a chance to get out. Belly almost got to it. Well, they may let Wicks pitch to Garcia. That's interesting. The 0-2 check swing. Did he go? Yes, he did. Struck him out. And Wicks able to get out of it. And runners at second and third with one out. Tockman now who is lined out. And he's walked. 2-2 two -two pitch. And he got him swinging. The slider from Arena. And Tockman's the second out of the inning. Here comes the pitch to Amaya. A swing and a miss. And the bat goes flying off the netting above the Cubs dugout. 1-1. One, one. A long time ago, that bat would have gone into the stands. And the pitch... Swing on, bouncing ball right side. Long run to his left for Simeon. He's got it. Throws in time. Simeon ranging far to his left on the outfield turf and able to get it to first to Walsh to retire Amaya and end the inning. Two away here in the Ranger half of the sixth. And that brings up Josh Young. Weather delivers. That's lined out to right field. Suzuki, I don't know if he lost it for a moment or what. Right past him. And Young's got a chance to go for three. Here he comes. Here comes a throw. Not a time he got in there. A triple for the Yungle Cat. There's no way he could have seen that ball in the lights there. Gets the triple and now El Bombe. I got the crowd into it a little bit. And this is popped up. Short center. Swanson going way out there. And it looked for a moment. I'm not sure if Bellinger might have had a little trouble. Half with three hits, including a double and a run batted in. 2-1. Slicing ladder the other way. Base hit. Ian Happ's got himself a four hit game. Got himself a four hit game, and he's got the go ahead run into scoring position here in the top half of the eighth. Two balls and a strike. The pitch. On the ground, softly hit. Young up with it to second for one. Bobbled at second. Zuki safe at first. They're going to walk Cody Bellinger, and an opportunity for Christopher Morell to be a hero. Breaking ball popped up. Young wants it. And we'll go to the bottom of the eighth inning. And here is Langford in a situation where a single could put the Rangers in front in the eighth. 3 2. Got him looking. Big strikeout, Hector Neris. He freezes Langford. And we're headed to the ninth here in Arlington. The Cubs now run have the bases loaded with one away in the ninth inning. I think Miles Mastroboni is going to bat for. Miguel Amaya. And he hits it on the ground. The play by Simeon to the plate. They get the force out. Two away. Now it's Ian Happ. A four hit game trying to be a hero. 3 2. Outside ball four, and the Cubs have the lead. Great day for Ian Happ. His base is loaded. Walk makes it 6 5 Chicago. Just didn't have it today. LeClerc is done. Bases loaded behind him. So now Jacob Latz. Suzuki the batter. Bases loaded two outs. Right-handed hitter, left-handed pitcher. Line drive. Base hit. Left field. Tockman is in. Mastroboni on his heels. Seiya Suzuki provides some insurance with a two-run single. 8-5. Cubs lead it. Bellinger is 0 for 2 and he's walked three times one of those walks intentional on the ground to first knocked down Walsh it squirts away from him around third on his way to the plate is happening he's in Cody Bellinger continues the trend from last year as he delivers against the lefty and it's 9 5 there are two outs with the Cubs leading 9 to 5 this is Josh Smith now batting for Duran a liner to right Suzuki is there ball game Cubs win Happy Easter happy Cubs fans a lot of them here enjoying this one 